So if your son or daughter is 18, 20, 22 years old and doesn't have the low barrack safety net necessarily, because again, as you said, you, you would be differently probably if, if you didn't have it. What would you be telling them now to focus on at this point in their careers and lives? And then sort of the corollary to that is what, what attributes and traits do you look for when you consider somebody a great woman or a great man? What are those things that really resonate for you? But what should they be thinking about right now? Well, well it's, a, it's a cliche, but I believe it with my core and it worked for me. And it's follow your passion. Uh, the problem comes if you don't know what your passion is. That's the issue. But if you know what your passion is and you follow that, you know, I, I wanted to be an actor. It's all I wanted to do. I didn't know I could be, I didn't know I could make money from it. I didn't particularly have an idea that I could even be famous from it. it was, I was in Ohio. What did I know about being famous? I didn't know I could get that either from it. Um, and I did it. And I, would, and I would do it again if I had to do it all over. Um, that's what I try to instill in both of my sons, is find that and you'll, and you'll never work a day in your life, as they say. And uh, to me, that's, that's number one.